and this time we're gonna do Diddy Kong's Quest, which is Donkey Kong Country 2. Uh, there's something different about this game is that you don't see Donkey Kong while well, he's in the game, but hardly. You're actually controlling Diddy and his girlfriend slash cousin slash sister slash relative slash friend, Dixie Kong. Um, and they're going on a quest to save Donkey Kong. Uh, more on that later, but actually this video is going to be more of a little bit of a talking um, discussion, if you will. Is that this might be a little bit more different than other my other Let's Plays, is that because I I'm going to try something and see if it works, it might not completely go as planned, but as you may have known by watching the some, some of my Let's Play videos in, the, in Donkey Kong Country, is I mentioned that I was going to do this game on a live stream and not Let's Play it. <laughs> But after trying and testing around and trying, um, I have about five or six people that said they'd like they'd be interested in watching it. But I, I think that the interest of the other people and their schedules and just their plain willingness to watch it, you know, and stay with it and actually participate in it for the amount of time I would do a live stream, which would be like maybe 40 minutes or an hour at a time, is that it wouldn't. It just wouldn't work very well. I don't think it would. So, with that said, uh, through through some advice of some friends and my own thinking, I have decided that I would have guest commentators on some of the videos. Now, not guest commentary as in I'd let's play and there'd be someone with me as I let's play. No, more so like a mystery theater type of style, like. I'll do a regular Let's Play video, and it will just be me talking, and it will be on YouTube, and you can watch it. But also, along with that, and a different, in a, it may be in a different playlist, it'd be like a Let's Group Commentate, or Let's Commentate Donkey Kong Country 2, and it could have one to five people all commentating on my Let's Play video. So, like, you'd hear me talk, and they could, you know... They could react to what I say, or laugh at it, or make fun of it, or could say it's awesome, or whatever, or just to sit there and talk to you, just like I would. But it just it'd just be something cool. It'd be like a bonus. And um, how I do that is that I would send my video to who'd want to watch it at that time, make it like a Skype group call, and have them comment it as. Uh, and I would record them and put my put their uh, sound file over m on my video, on the original video, and then upload it as a bonus. So hopefully you'll see some of that, and this could be the first one. So you know, as I'm talking, someone could be like, "Yeah, kind of like this," you know. They could be saying that, or you know, whatever. <laughs> Not everybody has the same style of talking as me, so who knows? They could be quiet for a long time and only talk a few times, but even that's pretty cool. So hopefully that will get that going, and you know I would say and in the video title and description I'd say who would be commentating that particular video. So it'd be very very varied and quite cool if it works. So let's let's hope for that. Uh, with that said, I guess there's nothing else to say except that I've never like beaten this game. I'm almost sure of it. I've gotten like maybe the world three or four. I kind of know what the the levels are like, but. It might, might get ugly, because I heard this is the hardest game. Um, and after this, I might be playing Donkey Kong Country uh, 3, which is... I, I've never... I've only seen screenshots of it. I've never even seen it in action. I know it's Dixie Kong is the main character, and that's it. And I... That would be completely blind run, so that'd be really interesting too. I heard it's just as hard, so and just as good. So, without further ado, let's do it. Let's quit looking at the damn top title screen. Probably like the fifth time. Uh, as you see, I haven't got no save files here. Uh, let's change this to stereo just for the hell of it. I don't think it's gonna do anything, but fuck it. Um, okay. One player, of course. And here's the overworld, a lot more you know, gr you know, gloomy looking than the first game. Gangplank Galleon is the first is the first world, and if you remember from the Let's Play or from Donkey Kong Country itself, the last level in the game where you fight King K. Rule, the last boss is uh, Gangplank Galleon. So it's kind of like a continuation right away. 
It's a ship wrecked ship, although it's a little bigger this time around. Pirate Panic, first level. Let's do it. Now I'm really disappointed that I don't get to see the um, video, the uh, music, or hear the music for this because it's outstanding. Some of this music's amazing, so but I'll get to see it on the video, so it's all worth it. So in here you get the little story. I've kidnapped that lumbering fool Donkey Kong, and you will never see him again. Har 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 har. Captain K. Rule. Little floating clue scroll. <laughs> kind of strange, but okay. I don't know how you kidnapped him, but okay. So we'll jump over the stairs. Jump on this guy. Here we go. And there's Dixie Kong. I like how she kind of does no in introduction. She's just there in the barrel. Um. The thing is that the traits, instead of Donkey Kong being able to hit like heavy enemies, I think Diddy Kong's faster climber, a little bit more like faster and more fa jumper jumper, and um, Dixie Kong's slower climber. But uh, she like uh, can do that, and that, you know she can float, and that's pretty useful. Um, you can also pick them up and throw them upwards like that, hit bonus levels, and hit enemies and stuff, and yeah, hit enemies too. So. Pretty cool when they fell in the water there. And there's banana coins in this game, and those are like currency. There's actually currency in this game. Like, to save a game a second time when you already saved it, you have to pay two of those. It's pretty crazy. And like to buy, play many games and use Funky Flight and stuff. Whoa. Hmm. Whoa. Whoa. Ah! Let's get in here. And the bonus levels are like this. It's like find the token or like kill the enemies or collect the stars. And then you do it and you have a time limit. Kind of like any bonus level. But you get a token at the end. Oh, grab this banana coin in there. Nice. And um, this is a creme coin or something. Creme luck coin? I don't know. Creme coin. And Kremlin coin. And what that does is that it uh, allows you to get to a secret lost world kind of like a special Star World or Mario, oh, no, Super Mario World and they have really hard levels to it and actually it's the real ending of the game I think so I'll be doing that too but I'll probably beat the game first legit before I do that Let's see Rambi can do a special move now charge right through there another bonus game already let's do it destroy the ball yeah <laughs> Kind of, I, I kind of just remember the music. And if you get hit once here, you, you uh, lose the bonus game, so you don't want to get hit. There you go. <laughs> Diddy kind of froze on that thing there. It looked kind of weird. But yeah, the game is actually really easy. Watch out, die though. It's really easy, but it gets hard quick, and it has like a gruesome difficulty curve. Like it gets just ridiculously, disgustingly hard, so. <sighs> Get ready for that. <laughs> Anything there? No, okay. And these signs no Rambi, you can't carry Rambi with you. But you get a, you get a two bonus balloon. And this is the exit. If you hit it if you hit the target from a from a high enough distance you get a carnival game like a carnival game kinda. You get what's displayed. So I want the banana coin. Gotcha. It's not always easy to time. And you get like a victory music. Did did uh Diddy does that rap thing and Dixie does like a guitar solo, it's kinda cool. And there you go, you get to the second level, Main Brace Mayhem. Um, so there'll be more progress in the other videos. I just had to discuss that little, you know, what might be happening here, and I hope it does. And if you see the DK coin, that means you got it, and the exclamation point means you got all the bonus levels, I think. So Pirate Panic DK coin, completely perfect there. So I'm going to try to do that, but I doubt it. I at least want to get to the Lost World, though, so I don't really care about the DK coins as much. So with that, I'll end this video. And uh, I'll see you guys sometime. I guess it should be next time for you. So next time. And hopefully we'll have some group commentators later. <laughs>